my six foot two self now has to shop for a dress. What just happened? Hi! So something came up and I'm suddenly going to a wedding on the 28th of this month. And that means that my six foot two self now has to shop for a dress. I'm making a little trip of it today because I'm going to try out a store that I've never been to before. But first, there is one place I must, I must go before I do any dress shopping. Hi, can I get a burrito? Oh, yes! Nothing like eating Chipotle in your car, am I right, ladies? Why is the first bite always the best one? All right, we're here. I have journeyed over to Nordstrom Rack. I've never been here before, but I have been on their website. I have heard that they maybe sometimes have clothes that can work for tall girls, and sometimes they have shoes that can work for tall girls. I know that they do online once in a while. I thought I would give the store a try. I'm looking for a dress. It's not like pants or anything that's crazy specific. So it begins. are really bad guys <laughs> like oh my gosh what is this it was so bad I even picked up one dress that was maybe okay but it was like a decent length that I would try it on anyway but then I looked at the price tag <laughs> put that back real quick there's a Kohl's next door though and I've gotten a lot of clothes there so I'm gonna hit them up next Kohl's don't fail me now I don't know where that accent came from I'm so sorry Oh, I got the first parking spot. Look at me. <laughs> <sighs> Round two. Ooh, a romper? Yeah, that's not gonna work. Aw, just what every woman wants. Itchy armpits. Is that a banana? I mean, it's like trying to cut your way through a jungle. Here you go. Thank you. What just happened? You guys, that never happens. I tried on one dress and that one dress worked and I bought it and I'm done. And this dress was on a clearance rack. So there was only one dress like it in the store in one size. A dress that fit was long enough and I liked it. That never freaking happens ever. I expected to be shopping for hours. Dress shopping when you are six foot two is impossible, especially when it's after season. I'm shook. <laughs> it's enough to bring a tear to your eye. Well, I guess we can go home now. <laughs> Psych. Right across the street is the store at home. <laughs> and the reason I never come over here is because it's quite a drive from where I live. So like, girl. I'm not going to drive all the way over here and not go to at home. Sorry if you can hear the AC, it's freaking hot. Yeah, and I got stared at by three people in there. I don't understand how people can like so blatantly stare at other people and just not even try to hide it. Although some people do try to hide it. They just don't do so very well. Like, if your head is down like this, but your eyes are like this, I'm going to see ya! <laughs> Gosh. And this other guy is just like, Yes? Can I help you? I've just learned to stare right back at them. Sometimes they notice me and they avert their gaze right away. Other times they don't even see because they're looking at how high the top of my head goes. So. Oh girl. Ooh, she's a fancy tree. 
Oh look guys, it's me at Christmas time. Well, I went to at home, spent like a half hour there and all I got was stared at. So, uh, I ended up here. <laughs> I'm not mad about it. Um, that's freaking cute. Like, if I don't get food right now, I'm gonna fall over. So I just got home, and that's basically me right now. So I just like immediately hung up my dress, made some vegan nugs, so I'll be right with you. All right, so I got home and hung up my dress. It is long enough, it goes just above my knees, but on a normal hate person, it probably goes like mid shin. But I kind of tried to show in the fitting room how like the torso of it is too short, where Basically, my chest is not in the place that it is meant to be with how this is sewn, so like, it's a little baggy on top, <laughs> but we just go and deal. We just go and deal. Whatever. You know, I'm probably the only one who's gonna know that, like, basically, like, the actual chest of the dress is all gonna be sitting, like, way up here, and like, <laughs> this is really weird to explain, but anyway, I might just be, like, tugging it down all night, but you know what? I am so freaking used to that, like, it ain't gonna deter me from buying it, so I bought it! And I'm so excited! Okay, picture this, picture this, because this is why I'm excited to go to this wedding. <sighs> I gotta calm down. Oh, look! Oh, look! <laughs> I'm gonna be walking up to the DJ booth, requesting Paper Rings by Taylor Swift, and dancing like a freaking maniac. Me in this dress. Oh, can you just see it? Can you just see it? <laughs> no. The shoes. I got two pairs of shoes that are like dressy that like I could wear to a wedding. So it don't matter if they go with this dress or not. One of them's gonna be worn. <laughs> it's so flipping hard for me to find shoes that that's just how it is. So the options. We've got these bronzy ones with like some really giant rhinestones on them. Or these silver metallic gladiator sandals that I wear to everything. I've had these since senior prom, no joke. And they're actually comfortable. I've worn them to like every special occasion ever since senior prom. And they're holding up. Like I've danced a lot of nights in those shoes and they're not even falling apart yet. Yeah, watch, I said that. Now they're gonna fall apart at this wedding. So since the dress is kind of light gray and greens, I believe silver is a go. It's 7.30, so you know what that means. Ah. So when I was at Kohl's buying the dress, I went to the checkout, I put it on the counter, and the lady goes, oh, that's a really pretty dress. And I'm like, thanks. Then we were talking about the dress, so I ended up saying, yeah, it's hard for me to find dresses long enough like this one, so when I do, I grab them. And she goes, for, y for you, yeah. <laughs> You know, just one more little thought here, okay? The Tall Girl movie on Netflix is coming out in a week. I'm so, so excited for it. I'm not gonna lie and say I haven't been doing that for the last hour. It's just something about a girl in a brand new dress. On that note, Yeah, this has been a weird day in the life of a tall girl. So, you know, if you feel like it, please subscribe and you'll see my reaction to the Tall Girl on Netflix movie when it comes out on the 13th, as well as a weird tall girl vlog every week. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go spin in like a hundred more circles till I pass out. Okay, bye!